people, guys. 624 is the time. Good morning, Tom. Good it's morning. time for our friends from Animal Samaritans. Who do we have here? This is Carmela. Carmela. Yeah. Brindle uh, Pit Mix. She's uh, still a puppy, big paw. She's going to be a big dog. Yeah. Um, and we've, I was mentioning, we've had a, a couple of litters. We've adopted out quite a few of the puppies, but we still have a, quite a few left. So our little shelter isn't really set up for large dogs. It's one of the downfalls we have, and that's why we're building a new one. Yeah. Um, but we'd like to get these, these uh, little pups adopted out before they get too big and um, we don't have room for them. So Carmella might just outgrow the kennel there. <laughs> out, she's that's got right. to do. Uh, absolutely. Adorable little dog though. Yeah. Looking for a good home. It just it was was brought in or how do we? Yeah, we got know? the whole litter. Oh, um, was abandoned. And uh, look, she, she's reaching out to somebody's heart right now. Oh, she's seeing yeah. herself on the camera saying, don't you want me? Yeah. So we've look had some that. of the puppies in with costumes <laughs> and we were talking about that. It's yeah. uh, we're approaching that time of the year and People are dressing up their pets. Okay. And it's huge business, as you know, really. Yeah. Uh, millions and millions of dollars earned on pet costumes, but sometimes people buy the wrong thing for their pet. They mm. try to force their pet into it. Um, just want to be careful when you're buying a pet outfit that you don't buy anything that's going to constrict around, that you have to tie around their neck or it's okay. like those thin cords. Um, anything that's going to weigh too heavy on their neck. We see people come out and they're, they're trying to be. Um, have fun, but their their pet's head is starts to droop, or they struggle oh. to breathe a little bit. Just mm. be real, really careful. Not everybody everybody's pets wants to be in a costume. Yeah, and if the pet doesn't want to do it, I mean, the natural, the, the nice thing to do is just don't force your pet. Absolutely. To do it. I mean, yeah. if, the, if the dog Try or the cat's into it, that's yeah. cool. But absolutely. Try a sweater, maybe, or a yeah. little something really simple, a Velcro cape or something. But um, just remember yeah. that it's it should be uh, comfortable for them. Little Carmela, a safety dog this morning. She's got a little orange safety <laughs> vest right. uh, going. You guys have uh, Men of the Desert coming up yeah. as well. Tell Thanks. us about yeah, that. Yeah, don't forget that. It's our big fundraiser. That's December 5th. Okay. First Sunday of uh, December. That's happening this year at the Palm Springs Air Museum. Fun. Um, the tick, the, uh, the invitations have gone out a little late because of the supply chain, right, for okay. envelopes. Okay. But they're in the mail. They should be in the mail this weekend. But uh, you don't have to wait for that. Give us a call. Um, it, again, Palm Springs Air Museum. It's always a popular event. Absolutely, it's yeah. It's going to be big. It sells out. If you want to find out more about little Carmela here or any of the dogs in the litter or any of the other, of yeah. course, pets. Uh, Lots cats, of kittens, too. Cats and dogs looking yep. for good homes. This is your chance. Uh, give Animal Samaritans a call. 760-601-3918. Or you can always go animalsamaritans.org online to get the details as well. Let's get little Carmela, such a sweetie, a good home here on a Friday morning. See you, Tom. You too. Have a great weekend. Thanks. Top stories are coming up next. You're watching the Desert's News Leader.